up you guys my name is Mary Grace and welcome to my channel don't forget to subscribe down below and follow me on Instagram but yeah I just wanted to do a little day in my life today I have really nothing exciting planned other than getting back into my routine today is like my first day back at my house at school and so I just finished walking the dogs, doing my skincare routine, and like these guys are just like hanging out with me, I guess. I guess they just wanted to be friends. And I'm not gonna pick out them. It's a new year, it's a new me. We're not gonna pick out our skin, even though it's so freaking tempting. It's not gonna happen. And then, what do I, what do I do today? What do I have to do? Oh yeah, I have so much laundry to do. Probably like four or five loads. I wanna wash our sheets. I just need to like clean up, get my life back together. Um, it is a Monday and it's ugh. But a week from today, I'll be starting back school. So I just want to get everything like done and organized. Thankfully, I unpacked everything yesterday, which is so surprising because that hardly ever happens. But um, I need to go to the bank today. I need really need to go to the gym but we'll see if i get there i'm not gonna like pressure myself to go today just because it is like my first day back and i just want to like get stuff done at the house but we'll see if that happens and then i think that's all we have so we'll just see where the day takes us but yeah thank you so much for all the support and love um, throughout this journey on YouTube. I'm so excited to see where it goes and I'm so excited to keep making videos for you guys. It's so fun and it's just, it, it really has been a dream of mine for so long and I'm so glad like I finally just like did it. And, um, but yeah, I'm so excited for this new journey and thank you so much for following along with me and subscribing to my channel and it just means so much. So let's get on with the day. Are you hungry little one? It's okay. Don't finish eating, okay? Coffee and this thing is like so weird. Like I just I don't get it. Sometimes it takes so long to make it and um do you hear it? Like that's what it sounds like. It's it's just so weird, but I like cold coffee, and so that is like for like cold brews, I guess. And I do not like it because like it just takes so long. So if you have any um, ideas for what coffee maker I should get, let me know. I don't like strong coffee, so keep that in mind. But yeah, I really need to get a new coffee maker. So. I literally hate doing dishes. Like, I can't decide if dishes or laundry is worse. Probably dishes, just because it's like, it can be grosser, but I just, I just do not like it. But yeah, just unloaded the dishwasher, and then I need to clean the kitchen a little bit, and then start on the laundry it's gonna be so fun the room isn't too big of a mess but like the sheets just need to be washed and i really just want to like organize stuff today because um 
we're getting a new dresser right here it's gonna be like long like fills up this whole space and so I just kind of want to go through all my stuff and get rid of some things before we get that so like only like new like fresh stuff can go in the dresser and it's not just like a bunch of random crap in there so yeah that is what I think I'm gonna do and then I need to wash these sheets because they are long overdue probably so let's get to it I freaking hate so we have a duvet and then a duvet cover and this is such a pain in the butt to try to like take apart and then put back on and all of that like oh my goodness Lily what are you doing Are you just going to sit on the bed while I'm trying to fix it or take it apart? Are you playing? Are you being a crazy girl? So I'm still waiting on my freaking coffee to finish but um, I just thought I would tell you guys like kind of like about me and like where I live and what I'm doing and stuff but I live in Statesboro with my boyfriend Caleb he goes we both go to school here and um, we kind of it's not like an apartment and it's not like a house it's like a I guess you would call it like a duplex um <clears throat> my main thing was like I didn't want to live in an apartment because when I lived in Charleston I lived in an apartment and I just hated it like it just apartments like are so small and they're not like homey and like we have like a yard here like it, I mean I wouldn't even consider it a yard because it's so small but um if I need to like let the doggies out I can let them out there instead of like having to walk them which we still go on walks like three times a day but um Say hey. She wants me to play with her toys. She just set it right there for me. But um, yeah, I just thought I would let you guys know in case you were wondering. But yeah, he has a full time job, so he's at work right now. And we start back school next week. So uh, that should be fun. I'm taking a lot of classes this semester. So. I'm really excited though because a lot of them are like my major classes so they'll be interesting instead of just like bullcrap classes which I hate but I know everyone does but yeah so we've been here since August and we really love it here so <laughs> do you like looking at yourself what about you Mimi Mimi you don't like looking at yourself? See, she is just the sweet, shy one. And she's so calm. And Lily, on the other hand, is the hyper one. See, like, she's just ready to play. I really need to, like, cut around her eyes because they are a little long. It looks like you have bangs, little girl. <laughs> they are so funny. So this is Lily, and then this is Mia. Mia's a Morty, and she will be six this year. That is so crazy, little girl. You are super duper pretty. And then Lily is a Maltese, and no. Mia will be five this year, and then Lily will be seven this year. It is so crazy. Like, I cannot believe that, but. Finally got the coffee. Oh, she looks so pretty. Don't judge me for how much cream I put in because that is how I like it. But she looks. Let's see if 
she tastes as good as she looks. Mm. Oh my gosh. So good. So, still trying to figure out the school stuff. And this is why I cannot get stressed out or get my nails done because I just like picked all of the gel off of my nails. So, like that's not cute just at all. Got ready. Now we're about to go to the gym. I'm just wearing this little crop top. This free people puffer that I'm obsessed with because it's still cold outside. Fabletics leggings and my Brooks tennis shoes. They are literally my favorite tennis shoes to work out in. I don't know what I'm going to do at the gym today, but I need to go by the bank and then go to the gym and do a workout. I think I'm just going to do, I've been really um, focusing on like cardio and just like I really do want to um, lose a few pounds and kind of just like tone up my muscle. So I've been doing the 12 through 30 workout. Um, Lauren, I cannot remember how to pronounce her last name, but she's the one that kind of like made that workout and it's kind of just like popped off on the internet and I really enjoy it. So I'm gonna do that. Just left the gym and holy cow. Those two weeks did something to me. Like, that is all sweat. That is disgusting and I look sick. I need to go home and take a shower. I just, or I stopped at the bank before I went to the gym and so now we're done with errands for the day. I, need a shower something terrible that sunlight is not helping either but i will see you guys when i get home just got out of the shower and feel so much better but i thought i would show you guys like the products i use after i get out of the shower not like skincare related like i think i want to do like a whole separate like get ready with me in a video and include like my skincare routine and all of that but just stuff that I use when I get out of the shower so y'all are literally sitting on two candles so I used to not um wash my hair every single day but Ever since we moved here, I've been having to because I guess the water is different. I don't really know, but like my hair is just getting, gotten oilier recently. And I really want to get one of those, um, what's it called? Like a filter, like a shower head filter, but I just haven't yet. That would have been a good, um... Christmas present but I think they sell them at like Home Depot or something but I've just started using this if it'll focus it's the way leave-in conditioner it literally smells so good like so good I didn't wash my I wash my hair like every other day when I was um, at home and I could still smell this in my hair after like two, three days. But I don't put it on like my roots or anything. I just put it on like my ends and a little bit higher than that. But it smells so good and it makes your hair so soft, which I love and like shiny. But I got that at Sephora. I can link it down below if you guys want and then I just use the wet brush I need to get my hair done but I think I want to do something different with my hair usually I just get like a lot of highlights like all the way to the top but I think I want to do like a um, root smudge and then um, do like the two 
money pieces like around my face but I don't know I feel like I would miss my blonde too much but I mean I would still be blonde but it just wouldn't be all the way to the root I don't know it's an option and then since I've already like done like my morning skincare routine I'm not gonna like do that all over again but I think I'm just gonna put um, some of this summer Friday jet lag mask on my face because since it's been getting a little colder my face has been dry just like everyone's but this product is my lifesaver I freaking love it it is just so moisturizing and it makes your skin like have that glow to it which is like all I've ever wanted so so good and it smells so good as well and then this is the Jack oh I don't understand why it takes it's so long to focus like I just want it to focus and be clear whatever this is the Jack Black intense therapy lip balm and this is the black tea and blackberry I have a bunch of these and I literally keep them everywhere this and then whoop, this one and then the Laneige are like my two favorites the Laneige one the lip sleeping mask stays on my nightstand though because I literally cannot go to sleep unless I put that on and it stays on like all night like I'll wake up in the morning and I'll still feel it and then usually when my hair is wet I put it up with a scrunchie I know that's probably not like the best thing to do but I cannot stand when I have wet hair touching my neck and scrunchies don't necessarily break your hair so I think it's okay and it's better than putting freaking heat on it I would say so Caleb doesn't get off till he said he'll call, he's gonna get home around 6 tonight and so I'm gonna like start doing dinner around 5 30 ish I think I'm not gonna tell y'all what we're having because it's kind of embarrassing but it's good you'll probably see it anyway so whatever we're doing hamburger helper <laughs> and I love it like I know it's not the healthiest but it's so easy and it's so good just making dinner we have some asparagus and then some hamburger helper because I'm going to end off this vlog here, but thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It means so much to me and um, leave any other suggestions or video ideas that you guys want to see in the comments. Um, I think I'm going to film a makeup routine or like a get ready with me uh, pretty soon, so be on the lookout for that and thank you so much. Love you all. Good night.